Hello, it's Monday, September 14th. I'm Keenan Smith. Two children escaped a burning home this morning on Detroit's east side. The kids were at home alone when the fire started near Hazel Ridge and Hayes. Crews were able to put out the flames. At this point, there's no word on what caused the fire. And corrections officers have regained control of a prison unit taken over by inmates in the Upper Peninsula. It happened last night at a f after a fight uh, during the Chippewa Correctional Facility. Officers used a taser on a prisoner who was then taken to the hospital. Inmates on that unit then left their cells and took over the unit. An emergency response team retook control and prisoners are now back in their cells. And Kid Rock will be at a campaign tonight in Harrison Township. He'll join Donald Trump Jr. and his girlfriend, Kimberly Guilfoyle, senior advisor to the president. It's all set for tonight at Bumpers Landing Boat Club. Now, if you want to go, you'll need to register with the club. Tomorrow, Dr. Jill Biden will campaign for her husband, Joe Biden, in Grand Rapids. She'll also join Governor Gretchen Whitmer in Battle Creek for a listening session with military families. And Amazon is stepping up a nationwide hiring blitz. The company plans to add 100,000 full and part-time jobs here in the U.S. and Canada. That's on top of the 33,000 corporate and technology jobs we told you about Amazon adding just last week. The roles offer a wage of at least $15 an hour. Amazon says the demand for online shopping continues to grow during the coronavirus pandemic. Sunny skies today and tomorrow, a high of 70 today, and then we drop into the 40s tonight. So tomorrow morning is going to be real cold, likely the coldest morning in three months. 73 the high tomorrow, up to 80 Wednesday. A cold front moves through Wednesday night, slight chance of rain Thursday morning, and it's going to be colder with highs in the lower to mid-60s this weekend.